ones that avoid it, pushing up them daisies. The type of shit that'll drive you crazy. Black child established in the 1980s. I seen things I will never forget. It's moments that I can't take back, but yet I regret. I treat life like a slinky, never skipping a step. I work out in bulletproof, don't do no exercise vest. The pawns move in all directions. I play checkers, not chess. And I burn this bitch down, you touch a chain on my neck. Wine glasses with lipstick, not easily impressed. It's yes, big sir, yes, sir. Yeah, 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 yeah. Lil Brunson back at you with the back at you, and I'm the best reporting on the Eagles. Listen, before we get into the meat and potatoes, real quick, this video was brought to you by Manscaped. Big Manscaped in the building, bringing you nothing but the latest and greatest cutting edge technology. Listen, Father Day, Father's Day coming. I'm giving you an easy way out. Use code Brunson, say 20% off, get the free shipping, and the free shipping I fall for that for y'all. Take care, pops. But do you see what I see? Oh, the little snippet of the music that y'all just heard, that song is called Smoke Salmon Zucchini. I don't know what I was thinking when I named it that, but it's fire, per the usual, and it's coming out, I don't know, I'll drop it soon, but I just seen my boy Brandon Graham, my boy Brandon Graham looking real spruce, looking real springly on the legs, Brandon Graham is back, ladies and gentlemen, the clip we saw from OTAs, you know what I mean, the clip I showed from OTA shows Brandon Graham basically full sprint ahead, chasing after the tackle dummy during drills, right next to him is Hassan Reddick, and they seem to be keeping up with each other in terms of speed and pop and getting off the ball, Brandon Graham is back, Brandon Graham is back, that was a huge, huge loss for us last year, because we had to depend on, you know, other ways of getting to the quarterback, especially playing in a new scheme. Brandon Graham would have really helped Jonathan Gannis scheme out a lot because Brandon Graham is versatile. He can play inside, outside, and I think Brandon Graham got the speed, you know what I'm saying, to you know be a little disruptive in the zone if you were to move him out in the flats versus a Fletcher Cox. You know what I mean? We were second to last in sacks last year. You lost a Pro Bowl edge rusher. Yes, Brandon Graham was a Pro Bowl edge rusher the year before he got hurt game uh, uh, week one. You know what I mean? You lost. You lost a leader. You lost a captain. And there's no wonder that the defensive, you know, the the rush. Well, the, the, the there's no wonder that the pressure suffered in that department. You lost one of the catalysts for it. So you know, I'm excited to see Brandon Graham back, man. People don't really see a lot of Eagles fans don't understand what Brandon Graham brings to the table or what Fletcher Cox brings to the table. They just keep saying stuff like this. Well, we need, you know what I mean? We need a 10-sack season. We need this. We need that. They're not doing this. Are they washed up? Are they getting old? But you don't understand these dudes create havoc up front. The pressure. You don't win a Super Bowl without this pressure. You don't. Who smacked the ball out of Tom Brady's hand? Brandon Graham is super disruptive. He might not get he might not get home all the time, but he's super, super disruptive, and he's very, very alert. QB keepers, I've seen Brandon Graham swallow a couple on up in his career. You know, I'm really excited. I'm excited about this Brandon Graham news because Brandon Graham is one of my favorite Eagles of all time. Definitely my favorite Eagle on the roster right now. You know what I mean? It's, it is what it is. BG is my guy. You know what I mean? And... I'm just happy that he's going to, I, I, know, I know what he brings to the table. He made the Pro Bowl with only eight sacks. Think about his last three years, though. If you, could, you can even add the missed year. He got more sacks than Tank Lawrence. More sacks than Tank Lawrence. Yeah. He missed the whole season and still got more sacks with Tank Lawrence in the last three years. So it's crazy, man. The production is going to come back in a big way. I can't wait to see, you know. What's coming down the pipe for the Philadelphia Eagles in terms of this run defense? Let me know what you think in the comments.